Aquarius. This is a peek at your partner for the week of February the 5th through February the 11th, 2023. Universal energies. Show me what I need to see for the partner of the star sign of Aquarius for February the 5th through February the 11th, 2023. Universal energies. Show me what I need to see. For the partner of the star sign of Aquarius for February the 5th through February the 11th, 2023. Universal energies, show me what I need to see. For the partner of the star sign of Aquarius for February the 5th through February the 11th, 2023. Show me. Happy birthday, Aquarius. Happy birthday. You guys, subscribe, like, comment, and share these videos. If this does not resonate with you, check your moon, rising, and Venus sign videos. I do not read reversals. So, Aquarius. Aquarius, this is a peek at your partner. So, Aquarius, your partner has the seven of wands. Your partner has the world. Your partner has the four of cups. Your partner has the ace of swords. And your partner has the six of cups. So, Aquarius, your partner has the seven of wands, Aries, Leo, or Sag. This is your partner being defensive. They're on the defense, but this can also speak to them being put in a position where they're having to defend themselves against rumors, gossip, and other people's opinions. Now, this can be your partner shunning someone, fighting someone off, setting boundaries with someone. But this is also an accusatory card. So your partner could be being accused of some type of rumors and gossip, and they're giving their defense or excuse here. So Aquarius, listen, your partner could tell me that they're staying off of shunning and setting boundaries with you. However, your partner could be trying to explain, give their explanation, excuse, or defense here. Clarify the Seven of Wands for Aquarius's partner. Clarify the Seven of Wands for Aquarius's partner. Clarify the Seven of Wands for Aquarius's partner. It is clarified with the Eight of Swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is your partner feeling stuck. Like they're in a self-imposed prison of their thoughts. This is your partner feeling like they can't move, but they can move because it's all mental. This is them refusing to see some things, refusing to acknowledge some things, a lack of information, block communication. This is your partner feeling stuck, trapped, and blocked. So listen, Aquarius, your partner could tell me that they're feeling stuck in a situation here, or there's block communication. Now listen, your partner could tell me that they want to come in and explain, give their explanation, excuse, or defense, but they're stuck. However, your partner could tell me that they're setting boundaries here. They're shunning you here and maybe blocking communication. Aquarius, your partner has the world. Your partner may be at a distance from you, either emotionally or physically at a distance. Your partner may have traveled recently or will travel in the near future. But the world symbolizes closing out a cycle to start a new cycle, closing out a chapter to start a new chapter. So listen, Aquarius, your partner could tell me that there's distance between you guys, emotional distance, a geographical distance. Your partner could tell me that a cycle is closing out completely or someone is wanting to come back around again. Clarify the world. For Aquarius's partner, clarify the world. For Aquarius's partner, clarify the world. For Aquarius's partner, it is clarified with the Emperor. Could be dealing with an Aries or a Taurus, but the Emperor is someone who runs empires. This is a boss, a business owner, CEO, independent contractor, manager. This is usually an older gentleman. It doesn't have to be, but someone who's wise yet stern. Someone who wants complete control and authority. Could be dealing with an Aries or a Taurus. Could be dealing with a spouse because the Emperor is a married, stable, committed person. 
Could be dealing with the parent of your child because the emperor is a father figure. Could also be dealing with someone you work with or do business with here. Clarify the emperor for Aquarius's partner. Clarify the emperor for Aquarius's partner. Clarify the emperor for Aquarius's partner. It is clarified with the three of wands. Aries, Leo, or Sag. This is your partner waiting, waiting for their ships to come in, waiting for what they set their intentions towards to manifest. Now, this is also a card of your partner looking to see what else is out there, looking to expand. So, Aquarius, listen, your partner could tell me that they're waiting. Your partner could tell me that the ships are here. Your partner could tell me that they're looking to see what else is out there, looking to expand or even travel. So, Aquarius, your partner could tell me that maybe they're waiting to see whether or not they're just going to close out the cycle completely. Maybe they're stuck, okay? Your partner could also tell me that, yes, a cycle is closing out completely. Now they're looking to see what else is out there. Could also be that some type of travel is here. Could be with work or business. Some type of travel is here. Aquarius, your partner has the four of cups, Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. There is an offer on the table that your partner is not accepting or rejecting. They're contemplating this offer, but actually they're bored with the offer, thinking of missing the offer. But this is also a card of your partner contemplating sending an offer, but they fear that the offer would be rejected. So Aquarius, very well could be an offer coming into your partner that they're thinking about missing. However, they could be contemplating sending a offer. They just have this fear it won't be accepted. Clarify the Four of Cups for Aquarius's partner. Clarify the Four of Cups for Aquarius's partner. Clarify the Four of Cups for Aquarius's partner. It is clarified with the Five of Wands. Aries, Leo, or Sag. This is conflict. This is fussing, fighting, disagreements, arguments, jealousy, competition, drama. But this can also speak to your partner being conflicted within about something. So listen, Aquarius, your partner could tell me that they're conflicted within about something. However, some type of conflict, disagreement, argument, drama may be taking place here. You know, your partner could tell me that they're conflicted within about whether or not to accept the cup or come in with this cup, this offer. However, the fact that they don't want this offer may be causing some type of conflict, disagreement, argument, some type of drama taking place here. Aquarius, your partner has the Ace of Swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is truth. This is clarity. This is communication. Now, this could be the sword of decision, the sword of victory. But this could also be the sword that one reels to sever a relationship. So, Aquarius, listen, your partner could tell me that you guys are having this communication. Your partner could tell me they've come into some truth and clarity. Your partner could be making a decision or using the sword to sever. Clarify the Ace of Swords for Aquarius's partner. Clarify the Ace of Swords for Aquarius's partner. Clarify the Ace of Swords for Aquarius's partner. It is clarified with the chariots. Could be dealing with a cancer. But your partner is determined to move forward confidently, victoriously, successfully ahead. Now, this can speak to travel. This can speak to relocating cities, states, countries. This can speak to moving from one residence to another or simply moving forward and leaving things behind. But your partner is determined to move forward confidently. So listen, Aquarius could be dealing with a cancer, but your partner is wanting to make some type of move here. Clarify the chariot. For Aquarius's partner, clarify the chariot. For Aquarius's partner, clarify the chariot. For Aquarius's partner, it is clarified with the star. This is you, Aquarius, but the star symbolizes having hope, having faith, healing, getting their wish, being divinely guided, following their destiny. So, Aquarius, this is you. Clarify the star for Aquarius's partner. Clarify the star for Aquarius's partner. What does Aquarius's partner think of Aquarius? What does Aquarius's partner think of Aquarius? Clarify the star for Aquarius's partner. 
it is clarified with the Queen of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This queen is usually stable, rooted, grounded, traditional, believes in the institution of marriage and family, someone who is good with managing finances and material resources. Could be dealing with Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or someone with Earth prominent in their chart. However, when we're dealing with the Queen of Pentacles, the Queen of Pentacles is a married, stable, committed person. So you could be dealing with a spouse. Queen of Pentacles is a nurturing, mothering energy. So you could be dealing with the parent of your child. Could be dealing with someone you work with or do business with or have some type of joint assets, resources, and property with. Or a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Clarify the Queen of Pentacles for Aquarius's partner. Clarify the Queen of Pentacles for Aquarius's partner. Clarify the Queen of Pentacles for Aquarius's partner. It is clarified with the Four of Wands. Aries, Leo, or Sag. This is the structure, the foundation of a solid, stable, committed relationship. This is leveling up the relationship. This is the marriage ceremony card. Now, we could be speaking of a celebration, a birthday party, anniversary party, baby shower, the home. But this is the marriage ceremony card. So listen, Aquarius, this can be about your partner's foundation, their stability. This can be about commitment, marriage, leveling up. This can be a ceremony, celebration, or even property here. You know, it very well could be that we're having this conversation, okay? Some type of conversation we're having here, okay? And is this an offer to travel? Because even though this is you, Aquarius, this is also a travel card here. Travel card. So is there a conversation being had about some type of relocation? Okay. Could also be some type of travel for work here. But your partner could also tell me that they're needing to make a decision concerning maybe some type of commitment or stability with you, Aquarius. Could also be, you know, like I said, some type of travel or wish concerning some type of travel for work or business for their stability sake, financial stability sake here. But it's causing some type of argument or they're just conflicted within and they're stuck here. Ugh, listen, Aquarius, your partner has a six of cups, Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is someone from their past. Flashback from the past. Full-fledged in the flesh. Someone from their past is back. Now, they can be reminiscing on someone from their past, remembering someone from their past, but something or someone from the past is being revisited. This is twin flame energy. This is reconciliation energy. So Aquarius, listen, you very well could be this person from their past. They're having feelings of nostalgia, wanting to reunite. Your partner could tell me that someone from your past is in the picture. Someone from their past is in the picture. Something from the past is being brought back up here, or this involves children. Clarify the Six of Cups for Aquarius's partner. Clarify the Six of Cups for Aquarius's partner. Clarify the Six of Cups for Aquarius's partner. It is clarified with the Nine of Cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is wish fulfillment. But this can also speak to your partner feeling smug or overindulging in alcohol or substance abuse. So Aquarius, listen, your partner could tell me that they're getting their wish. They could be feeling smug here or overindulging, trying to numb out. You know, maybe it's their wish to go towards someone, from, not someone, I'm sorry, something from the past here. And it could be an employer, maybe somewhere out of town, some type of travel here. It may be their wish and it may be causing an argument. Your partner could also tell me that it's their wish that you guys reunite here because it could have been some type of block communication. Like your partner could be waiting to see whether or not we're going to come back around again to one another because it seems like they want to have a conversation about commitment or stability here. Aquarius, this is a peek at your partner for the week of February the 5th through February the 11th, 2023. You guys give me feedback, subscribe, like, comment, and share. And follow me on Twitter at Her Immortal Maj, M-A-J, and I'll see you guys next week. Peace.